Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to Video Diary 81. Alright, so this was last night's video. And, uh, well, here's what I did last night, or yesterday in general. Great, phone rings, internet disconnected. Don't care. Um, alright, so, uh, first off, my Mountain Dew didn't bust. Yes, it was my last can, so I was like, yay! But now I'm sad because it's half gone. Or, right, anyway. So yesterday, I caught up on the new episodes on Hulu, like I normally do every day. I was upstairs, back and forth. See, I get this thing, like, my legs ache, you know, from the kneecap down to my ankles. Um, they ache constantly. It's kind of like RLS, <clears throat> which is restless leg syndrome, and, uh... It just drives me crazy. On top of having a fucking migraine, it doesn't help, and my stomach hurts. And I mean, like, I'm still dizzy headed, like, from time to time, but I'm doing okay now. Yeah, sure, I'm a little sick, and here's the thing that pisses me off the most. When it comes to being sick in my family, um, I'm either the first to get it, or the last to get it, and sometimes I'm both, which really sucks on my part because. When I get sick, I get sick for three months at a time. And then as soon as I get better, I get sick again. So, yeah, right now my grandma's got it. And my grandpa is catching it, which is very bad for him because he's got emphysema. He can't breathe well as it is unless he's on his oxygen tank. Um, let me see here. Yeah. I have a bad immune system as it is. So, staying sick for three months and then getting sick again doesn't help along with having a uh, strep throat and see uh, I, th I think I've mentioned this before I am a carrier of strep which means I was born with strep throat and I'll die with it see it's like you know how bad strep throat gets you know like your your throat's always sore and it's red constantly my throat has always been like that and someone's talking outside I think he's talking to his dad, that was my cousin James. Anyway, um, yeah, right now I've got a migraine, but that's beside the point. Um, yeah, I, I'm still wearing this hat. I've worn it every day since I bought it. Sure, it's still a little tight around my head, but it's getting loose er, And I still say it's too small for my head. And, yeah. What do you guys think? I mean, I love the uh, design on it the black and gray plaid or uh, what's the other word for it? um shit I know the word and it's right there on the tip of my tongue but like when I think about what the word is I can't remember it um flannel there we go almost kind of like flannel but not but yeah anyway um I got this hat and I've got the Miami ink hat that's just like it let, let me show you um see yes it's upside down there's a dead bug in it you can't really see it, but it's been there for a month now, and I don't want to touch it. It might give me something. The longer it stays there, the longer I'm going to have to wash my hat. But yeah, see? Same design. Alright, anyway, uh, watched Hulu. Ah, shit, it almost fell. I watched Hulu. Uh, I don't even remember what I was talking about now. Fuck. Um, yeah, uh, upstairs walking back and forth because my legs okay I got that part I got the Hulu part um I did go to the grocery store for my mom not my mom but my grandma and my grandpa because my sister and cousin needed some cookies for some kind of school project well not project but school party or something like that so I went to the store I got that I bought me a pack of smokes which are gone now as you noticed in the video before this one um also uh, I walked last night, and I, I stayed gone for a few hours, I was just listening to my music, sure, it was cold as hell, and, uh, I wore that coat, the one that I can't move around in, you know, my Eskimo jacket, as I call it, I wore it, and, uh, it kept me warm, but the more I walked, the hotter it got inside the coat, so my arms were sticking to the material, and that wasn't fun, mm -mm. and, uh, of course, that brings me back to being sick. I don't really make the smartest of choices. And, um, yeah.
But my excuse was, oh, well, I was told that I had to get up and move around to get better. But then they'd come back with something like, yeah, well, it was cold outside. You're sick and you're even more sick. So, yeah, like I said, I'm not that bright. Mm. Oh, shit, I don't know. Um, uh, other than that, I don't remember what I did. Hmm. I think it was yesterday, or well, the day before, I went to the laundromat with my, I don't remember what day that was, shit, never mind, but yeah, there was something that involved the laundromat, and helped my aunt wash her clothes, and blankets, and it was $40, yeah, I talked about this once, I believe, but I don't remember, ah, uh, shit, fuck it, I don't remember, but, uh, yeah, ugh, you know, when a hat is tight on your head, it doesn't really help. Oh, great, my hair is a mess. But yeah, it doesn't help when you have a headache that starts from right here, where that scar is on my head all the way up through here. And then it wants to fuck with me even more and go all the way down to my nose, and then my sinus hurts, and the whole sinus headache plus the scar headaches, so it doesn't really help any. Oh yeah, another thing that I did, um... I found a TV show called Smallville. It came out in 2001, and I watched maybe one or two seasons of it before. But now there's 10 seasons, maybe 11, I don't know. But I know there's 10, at least, on DVD. Um, I found it on a website called SideRail.com, and uh, I ended up watching two episodes, well, one and a half. That's how I went walking, but yeah. I was going to watch it again today, but didn't. Which reminds me, I've still got to make one more video. Ow, that hurt. I just cut myself. Oh well. Eh, I'm gonna go. Yeah, later guys.